what's up youtube this is nick ross right now you're watching body of legends so right now you're watching a posing video of me this is going to be week one back on my diet back on my shit back on everything guys um you know everything that i'm doing right now leading up to my future competition plans um if all goes well i'm going to be competing in june or july of next year it's going to be at fitcon 2014 hosted by Big J by Big J Extreme Fitness and Mark Lobliner uh, representing AMBF Natural um, Organization of Bodybuilding but you know, um, my dedication right now, my focus, my drive my passion for wanting to do this right now is immaculate, it's beyond anything that I've ever previously felt when it comes to wanting to put so much effort towards one single thing and I feel that, I feel a lot of effort and I feel a lot of focus and drive to just succeed. And at this point, at this stage of my life right now with the way that I'm thinking, I cannot lose, I cannot fail, I cannot not succeed. And what I mean by I cannot fail, I do not mean winning or becoming runner up or even top five. Winning or achieving success in my own personal eyes is only bringing my best Bringing my best means that I will do every single thing that I possibly can do to bring the best package that I can possibly bring On that one day that I do step on stage There shouldn't be any variable possible that I could have ever done in the past few weeks or months prior to that show that will alter my physique for the better because it should have already been done to peak me and to become my best. And if I don't bring my best, then ultimately I feel even if I do win without bringing my best, it's still a failure, a personal failure. So this right now is just more so a personal test to bring my best. Um, I do have a few weak points. Um, as you can see, some of the posing here is a little awkward. I haven't posed in a while. It's been a few weeks. I've been off of my game a little bit. It's taking some time away from the heavy training, the um, dieting. Um, not time away from the gym, just time away from a certain training style and a certain kind of dieting. Give myself a little more freedom. But as you can see, I still maintain a little bit of um, you know, conditioning. I'm not completely off. I still have abs, separation in my quads. But... You know, you can see my chest is lagging, you can see my pose, and once again, needs a little bit of work. My side shots aren't that great right now because I don't have that side sweep on my chest. But all those things can be worked on, even like a little loose skin on my lower abdominals, but that can also be tightened up, guys. Um, so right now, just little things like that. And sorry, once again, I didn't show calves in this video. I realized that after I filmed it. Next pose and video, I will have calves. I guarantee you that, guys. So you, I don't want anyone saying that I got small calves, whatever. Work very hard for my legs. Um, you know, if, if anything, I, I've always had, like, strong legs. Um, I mean, if you look at me back in 2011, I had, you know, big quads. I've always had legs. Um, but, I mean, I had injury this year. It kind of set me back. So I did lose a little bit of size in my legs. But finally working up back up to that. But anyways, guys, I appreciate everyone for watching my posing video. I appreciate everyone for watching this video. I appreciate everyone for supporting the channel, watching the channel. I appreciate everyone for subscribing, liking, commenting, rating, everything that everyone does right now. I appreciate that. It's very appreciated. And I can only go up. You know, the only thing that can bring me down is death. And I don't plan dying anytime soon. Nick Ross, Body of Legends, guys. Tune in for next time. Thank you very much. And I will see you next time. Well, not really. I don't see you. You'll see me next time. But I will definitely make a video for you guys in about a few days. So that's my next time, guys. Bye-bye.